All right, today I'm going to show you how to connect your Hubson battery to a standard um, LiPo charger. So Hubson QC, I'll uh, put the link down to his video below. He's already done it. But what he did was took the cable and cut it and um, made a mod on the cable. But what I want to do is make it something that you can just plug into the cable that you already have and then plug it into here. So what I've done, I'm not going to go through the soldering process and all that. I'll just show you pretty much the pinouts and why I did it. So if you look here with the tabs up, let's see if I can get that in there. The black is on the right, the red's on the left. So what I did, if this meets in here, the red's on the left and the black's on the right. So that would hook up nice. So this is the male end, it has the plugs in there. There's the female end. So this end's gonna go into your charger. This end's gonna go into here. So for the, the only ones you're really worried about, if you have a cable that you bought, so you're just worried about the outer pins here. But what I did was I took an old charger that I had and desoldered the plug off of there and that's what this is and this is just an old cable off of a battery so the ending the like i said the ones on the end i went ahead and took a banana connector and then twisted that with the wire on the outside of the red and soldered it to that pin and over here i took the black lead and connected it with this cable here on the end and soldered it on that pin, and then just soldered the two middle ends together. Or two middle ends like they were, straight uh, straight through. So I'll plug in like we would normally. I'll plug the battery in. So I'll plug in everything here first. So output red and black, plug those in first. And then Cable goes into the 3S port, and then this goes into your battery. And the battery is 11.4 volts, so that tells me it's probably an LIHV, as he mentioned in his video also. Let's plug it in, and then we'll just hit charge. There we go. You can see that it's charging. It was almost charged fully, so that's it. So again, it's just a quick way that you can um, use a balanced charger instead of using the supplied charger that, that takes a long time. And uh, if you like my video, please like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.